Hey readers, I want to talk to you a little bit today about how your voice sounds when you're reading. Sometimes when you're learning how to read a new book, you might sound a little bit like a robot. Let me show you. The um, aquarium? You might have a little bit of questions and you might be a little bit unsure about some of the words. Here are Mario and Billy. Okay, so sometimes your voice might not sound like a teacher when you're reading new books, and that is totally understandable. Learning to read takes a lot of work, but when you are reading those books that you have read over and over and over again, I want you to try to make your voice sound like a teacher voice. <gasps> can you do that? Oh my gosh, if you can read like a teacher, I might let you have my job for the day. All right, guys, when you're reading the books that you've read over and over again, try to make your voice sound like a teacher. Waiting is not easy. That means that you might sound excited during excited parts, or you might sound sad during sad parts, or your voice just might sound totally normal, like you're talking or having a conversation with somebody. So, try to read just like a teacher today. We'll see who's going to teach us reading next week. Maybe it's one of you. Bye, guys.